The village tonight full of ghosts and goblins and just about anything you can imagine. Thousands turned out for New York's annual Halloween parade that marched its way up 6th Avenue. Iowa News News reporter Lucy Yang was there. It's not a Halloween party without a little thriller. Despite being on a Monday and despite a little rain at the end, it did not disappoint. <laughs> Leading the procession for the first time, an all-women brass band from Brooklyn. Then came ghouls and goblins and all sorts of scary creatures. I am Swamp Man of NYC. Oh, the theme this year is freedom. And if there's any parade that's free from rules and restrictions and even reality, it's this one. My name is Skippy the Skelly. And I'm here to haunt your dreams. Perhaps the most dreaded costume. I'm inflation. <laughs> we don't like you. We don't like me. It doesn't look like I'm going to be cleaning my bathroom anytime soon. <laughs> Some were ethereal, many bloody. There were slithering snakes and ancient gods. Some went for high art. They let you out of the museum? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, for one night only. Others for high danger. <laughs> in the city. With thousands marching and even more cheering, this parade has earned a place on the international bucket list. Emily from Paris just turned 25 and this is exactly where she wanted to spend her birthday. Amazing! It's amazing! Dracula was also from France, Glowworm from Boston, the pumpkin patch from San Antonio, Texas. These glow pandas, a nod to the Beijing Olympics. How are you? I'm Boris. This is Natasha. <laughs> How you doing, Lucy? I watched you for a lot of years. If you've been around a lot of years, you'll understand this pair. Ten-year-old Arena is from Ukraine, trying to enjoy a night of fun far from the war in her homeland. What do you think of this parade? Very cool and so beautiful. 49th annual New York Village Halloween Parade didn't miss a beat. 